I hate being this kind of wedding guest, the one that's now stuck sitting alone in the back corner because they didn't know where to sit me. <sighs> At least the wedding ceremony was beautiful. And well, I mean, they do have some yummy food for dinner. Oh, and then there's wedding cake too. Mm. Wow, did they seriously sit me all alone over here? Uh, oh, there's another place setting. So it was just meant to be two people sitting here at this big table. Well, isn't that just my luck? Whoever was supposed to sit next to me probably bailed last minute. Oh, I hate that. If you RSVP somewhere, then you should be courteous enough to at least make it. Well, unless something happened. Way to go, Mia. Thinking the worst of a stranger. A stranger who knows your friend. So like, a friend-in-law? Is that, is that how it would go? I don't know. Oh. <clears throat> Hi, uh, sorry, I was sort of in my head. Uh, huh? Oh, yeah, yeah, this is table 32. Uh, hey, hey, wait, do I? Oh, oh my god, oh my god, I do know you. <laughs> yes, yes, it's Mia from high school. Oh my gosh, uh, can I... Can I hug you or, oh, mm. oh my God, it is so good to see you. It's been forever, hasn't it? <laughs> yeah, um, no, sit, I'm sorry. I kind of just stopped you from taking your seat. <laughs> Did, okay, back up. How do you, oh, you work with the groom? Oh my god. Uh, yeah, I, um, I've actually known her forever. She ended up going to a different high school, so she wasn't there when we were going, but yeah, I, I grew up with her. She lived right across the street from me, but how are you? <laughs> I know, I'm, I'm sorry, I just can't stop looking at you. It's sort of surreal. I I never thought I was going to see you again. I know that that sounds very cryptic, doesn't it? Um, but God, look at you. You look great. Um, me? <laughs> no, this is, this is kind of a out of my comfort zone sort of thing. <laughs> yeah, I don't, I mean, I like dresses, but... This is way formal. <laughs> I'm used to, like, having little summer dresses or something. And these heels, I swear, they are going to break my ankles. <laughs> yeah, exactly. But they look cute, right? <laughs> um, but how, uh, how have you been? What have, what have you been up to? God, it's been years. Years. I... When was the last time I saw you? Was it like, it was the party after graduation, huh? Yeah, yeah, and then you ended up moving away for that big shot college. How, how was it? I, I know it's been a couple of years since we've been out of college, but you're, you're still going to school? You're getting your PhD. I am not surprised. I always feel like you were meant for some great things. So what is it that you're studying? You don't want to get into it, and why is that? Because you think I'm going <laughs> to... No, I don't think I will fall asleep. 
Um, I'm sort of a nerd myself, I guess. <laughs> well, I, um, I decided to follow my engineering <laughs> goals, I guess. Yeah, me, right? The one who was terrible in physics, but college kind of pulled it out of me, I guess. And I had some really great professors. Yeah, I'm an electrical engineer. <laughs> I would choose the one that you weren't good in. <laughs> um, I, uh, um... Are you, uh, this is forward, but are you seeing anyone? Well, I don't know. It's, you know, we're at a wedding. You start thinking about other people's romantic life, I guess. I, okay, well, now I'm really embarrassed by my question and just second guessing it, but uh, you're not, you're not married, right? You're not? Okay, that's cool. N me? No, no, I'm not seeing anyone or with anyone. I guess I could ask you that same question, but for me, I don't know. I just haven't met the right person. <laughs> I think you kind of ruined me, actually. Yeah. <laughs> well, you were my first love and I constantly compared other men to you and they could never live up and I know we were only in high school but you treated me exactly how I wanted to be treated <laughs> and I don't know I I had always thought I would be with someone who was like you, who was kind and a big old nerd, <laughs> who gave the best hugs and who, <laughs> who was never shy to give me a kiss on the cheek in front of everybody or, I don't know, someone who just read me and knew what was wrong without me having to say anything. It was like, I don't know, we were, yeah, in total sync. My, my mom used to say that we were like magnets. <laughs> and um, she always wondered what happened to us. Well... <laughs> I was never going to stop you from pursuing your dreams. And you were never the type to make me choose between my dreams and yours. So, yeah, I think about it too. I think a lot about what ifs. <laughs> but, but what about you? Why... Why haven't you landed with somebody <laughs> pretty much the same thing? <laughs> I will say there was someone who was a little more serious than others. Uh, but in the grand scheme of things, he wanted things that I really wasn't ready for. Or that I couldn't imagine having with him it's weird I I don't know it must be the ambiance and being at a wedding and being surrounded by romance but I always thought it would be us one day sitting where they are at that wedding table <laughs> So, I don't know, I guess it, yeah, yes, exactly. It feels like we were meant to see each other again. Also weird, but there's only two 
plates here. I guess they didn't know where to put us, so they stuck us together. <laughs> yeah, I guess it kind of does remind me of back in the day. <laughs> we were always the little outcasts, huh? But that's why we worked. <laughs> oh my god. <laughs> I love this song. <laughs> um, would you maybe like to dance with me? No, I think you might have to hold me tighter against you because I'm very serious about these shoes. If I try going a faster than a slow crawl, <laughs> my ankles are going to break. <sighs> yeah, I'm really happy to see you too. <laughs> now, come on, you have to go prop me up against you as we dance. <laughs> 